situation is a blessing in disguise um he tried to hurt Siri re Harvey reset my phone it did not turn back on it started back doing what it had been doing that whole day already so I ended up rushing to the Apple Sack store in another city which was like 20-30 minutes away I ended up driving like an hour back to my place anyways the Apple Sack guy was pretty cool and nice I do not remember his name but he is amazing. He's a nice guy, but he did not was able he was not able to record from my phone because my phone had an error nine. Um, I'm not about to explain what an error nine is. <laughs> but um yeah, my phone was set for it. So I was like, alright, cool, I'm gonna go ahead and send it this thing. Mind you, I'm driving with my iPad as my GPS. Have y'all seen my iPad? Ignore all of my acting stuff on there and car stuff. But I need a new case. That's another story in life. Um, so yeah, my phone, I didn't have a phone until 11.53 the next day. I proceeded to follow instructions on the paperwork that they gave me. And the whoever I was talking to online took a whole hour to message me to the point where I went and took a shower. They finally messaged me back and I was like, whatever. So I just packed up, got dressed, drove to the nearest at and store and got help to make sure that my phone was turned back on accurately um, and had my service. Um, and that's about it. I got everything that I needed. I'm so blessed to even have a new phone because I had an XR. It was time for an update. I've had that phone since Thanksgiving of 2018. It's now 2023. And I was going to get a new phone and just keep that one because I'm up changing over all my stuff from a commercial account to a business. <sighs> Baby, I'll never do that again. Anyways, I got a new phone. It's an uh, 11 this time. And my phone that I'm getting with my business account is supposed to be a 13. I'm hoping. If not, I will just probably wait and get another. But it was my phone from a business account because I'm going to switch all my stuff out of my phone. And just keep this as my personal phone for now um because i just want to separate myself so i don't have this issue again because everything on my iCloud is connected to my ipad my, my mini ipad my macbook air like it's all connected under one iCloud account and that's way too much and i should have not did that when i got my ipad but it's okay i'm going to redo everything so um I don't, i've ran so many errands this morning um, I had a couple of business calls, um, debating with some certificate programs with me and my homegirl Amber. We've just been talking about just trying to get everything together. And I swear, like I said before in my last video, this year has been crazy for your girls. So I'm about to go into the grocery store and get a few things. I'm a Sprouts girly. Somebody told me that I need to get on Trader Joe's. Um, I'll eventually go there. Probably not this week because my week is, this week is so heavy. I'll go next week. Because um, I, I, I wanted to go in that store anyways because apparently they have some oatmeal with like protein and like flax seeds and stuff. And I would love that because that would keep me from buying the separate packets and trying to pour it into the oatmeal in the morning and doing all the extra stuff that I need to do. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to get myself back on a good, healthy, focused routine so I can execute my days quicker and faster and um, get my body where I want it to be because I feel so chunky <laughs> 
it went under eyes or something but i'm trying to stay away from makeup i, I usually try to stay away from makeup anyways if i'm not filming i was because somebody was looking at me and i'm like why are you in my car anyways um i'm really trying to this is not just for me as well i want to get my body here because i don't want my body to be in a certain place and also because i'm used to it being in a certain space and i've been saying this for a long time stress eating is my biggest problem this is not junk food. I don't do sodas. I haven't done sodas since college of my freshman year because it was banned. Um, people don't realize how big of a sport band is because we have to stay fit and work out and sweat and be in those hot band uniforms all the time. So going to Alabama State, being a marching band, shout out all my marching hornets. Anyways, um, that was a reflex because I didn't do that on purpose. Anyways, just trying to get everything. To where I want it to be. My business, myself, my career. My biggest focus this year has just been me, my relationship with God, my career, and making sure I'm there as a TT because I have not been recently this year as I said before and I hate that. But I try to make sure I at least call my babies, text my babies, try to pop up on them, show up to a game, something, you know, or just check up on them be calling my friends and be like so you just call for the kids yes yes and i've been trying to at least call to be there for the first days of school and everything i'm just i'm low-key a parent and i'm okay with that i love that part of me because i don't have any kids and um i may get there one day i don't know um i feel like i've been through some things where trying to get over some other things and didn't realize that I was over some things and I've did the self work for that thank god oh the gross anyways um I just experienced some crazy stuff bruh chocolate high situations where you pretend to be somebody but that's not really who you are or what you really want in the, in the beginning I've also experienced the guys where oh I've talked to other women and they talk about the things they want to do but they don't actually do it and you do it and so that's a problem for me because I feel like you're gonna make more money than me and be more successful than me and I think that's crazy and I'm not selling this up I'm not making up this verbatim the words I've heard and it's just like you know what I'm gonna be patient wait on God and get myself together and where I want to be and right now with this strike I really have been working on myself I've been working with all of my friends and just looking for jobs and stuff like that and I'm like I don't think I'm gonna get a good job <laughs> everybody's hiring for like 14 to 16 an hour and it's ridiculous it's rather you're over over qualified under qualified or they just ignore you and pass you up for somebody else and I'm like you know what I need to create my own crap and get my stuff together so if I have to work every day and get a couple of hours of sleep that's cool some days I sleep in or and just go out the other half of the day but um let me get into the store and get what I need so Cause my day is not over by any chance. What I'm gonna need to go in this grocery store and get some healthy things to eat. I have been eating a lot of salads, oats, and grains. I do the avocado, eggs, and protein shakes in the morning. I think it's in my middays and then my nights. Um, I may have to take a break from ramen for a little bit, but then again, I do rice ramen slice of ramen but I don't know um, I don't know we're gonna figure this out we're gonna figure this out anyways we'll see y'all in a little Crossing. You 
each other. That's not cute. Um, I've been up since 5 o'clock. Did I move at 5 o'clock? No. Um, I even had a personal, I had one of my friends call me to make sure that my behind was up. Was that up? No. Um, it's been a day to say the least, but I've crossed out mostly everything on my to-do list. And um, we in this thing. I was supposed to record a whole bunch of BTS and a lot of other videos. One of the things that I've been doing today, did I do that? No. Baby. Life is life. Life is life. In. But I promise you this content is going to get better. I promise. Um, we have some good things coming up. I have a celebration that I'm going to on the 19th, including a music event. And I'm also taking my big brother and my cousin to Six Flags next week if it does not rain. If it rains, we're going to do something else. But, um, definitely have a whole bunch of things coming up next. So, just look out for your girl. I want to thank you for whoever is tuning in to my videos. I know they're short. I know it's not much. But I said I was going to be consistent with this for the rest of the month. So, here and cheers to that. You feel me? So, just look out for me next Tuesday. Um, and eventually we'll come up with a scheduled time for when this will be posted. Maybe, maybe not. I'm not sure yet. But, um, 